three important developments about Ethiopia's uh, Tigray, Amhara, Oromia and Benishang al regions. Firstly, reportedly, Oromo Liberation Army has set up checkpoints along uh, Kenya-Ethiopia main road. The road is not blocked, but uh, OLA is now controlling this road by setting up checkpoints. At which points uh, along this road OLA has set up checkpoints? Uh, are these checkpoints close to Moali border crossing? Or the checkpoints are in Guji? I'll have a look at that. Uh, we have some videos as well showing uh, long queues of vehicles along this road and OLA fighters seem to be uh, controlling the checkpoints along this road. Secondly, uh, Ethiopian government officials are claiming, not officially, that an Egyptian reconnaissance drone has been shot down over uh, the site uh, where Ethiopian uh, Renaissance Dam has been constructed. Uh, we'll talk about that. Thirdly, some Amhara news sources are claiming that around 2,000 TDF fighters have been taken prisoner near Gase. Gase is just 17 kilometers away from Debre Tabo towards Nifas Micha. We'll have a look at this claim too. Firstly, viewers, Roman Liberation Army is in control of. Uh, Ethiopia Kenya road it has uh, set up some checkpoints along this road now important question viewers is where has OLA set up checkpoints we are receiving two different reports uh, one report uh, says that the checkpoints uh, have been set up uh, in Miyu Woreda Miyu is very close to Moali border crossing between Ethiopia and Kenya. Miyu is in Burana zone. If these checkpoints are in Miyu Woreda, it means that this entire road, Ethiopia Kenya road, is under the control of OLA. But most of the sources are saying that these checkpoints are not in Miyu Woreda. The checkpoints are in Guji zone and Jebalo Guji road uh, is, is uh, the place uh, uh, where uh, these checkpoints have been set up. So, Jebalo Guji road is under the control of Roman Liberation Army. Uh, Jebalo uh, road, which passes through SNNPR. It's uh, still open and traffic is moving along this road. Uh, watch the video showing OLA fighters uh, along this road, Ethiopia Kenya Road. Reportedly, they are in Guji zone, and Yabalo Guji uh, link of this road is under OLA's control. Now it's very much clear that in southern Oromia, in Guji, Burana, Oromo Bish Army is making gains, it's taking control of territories, it's taking control of key roads, uh, and uh, but uh, main road, Ethiopia, Kenya road, it's not totally blocked so far. Secondly, words, uh, an Egyptian reconnaissance drone has been shot down by an Ethiopian air defense system in Benishangal Gumaz region of Ethiopia. The drone was over the dam site, Renaissance Dam, 
good grand ethiopian renaissance dam it was a spy drone a reconnaissance drone and uh, air defense system spotted the drone and it has been shot down we don't have any pictures or videos ethiopian government has not shared any pictures videos no statement has been issued so far but uh, some ethiopian government officials are anonymously claiming that this reconnaissance drone has been shot down by ethiopian uh, air defense systems uh, there is three layer uh, security deployed at ethiopian dam site i did a video on that you can watch the video or you can see the link on your screen at the end of my video uh, there is also the link if you click that link you'll be able to see the video that i made a few weeks ago about uh, three layered security deployed at ethiopian dam site in banishangal gomaz region ethiopia has deployed uh, short range and medium range air defense systems at the dam site we are waiting for some official confirmation lastly we are uh, some amhara news sources are claiming that tdf's advance towards debre tabor has been completely checked and more than 2000 tdf soldiers have been taken prisoner in gase gase is just 17 kilometers away from debre tabor towards nifas which you can see gase on your uh, screen uh and these sources are saying that these uh, tdf soldiers have been taken to debre tabor city they were taken prisoner but the uh, these very sources uh, claimed a few days ago that uh, matthew had been taken by endf that uh, uh, coram had been taken by uh, ethiopian national defense forces that main uh macho uh, macle road had been cut off then we heard rumors about adegrat but none of them could be confirmed so far no evidence has been shared so far by these uh, sources now we are hearing these claims that 2000 tdf soldiers have been taken prisoner in gase again no pictures no videos no confirmation at the same time uh, we are not hearing anything from tdf as well tdf uh, yesterday tplf li news source has said that tdf uh, had entered debrete war no pictures no videos uh, from debrete war so far uh, but this claim by amhara news source is that they have taken prison more than 2000 tdf soldiers it must be backed uh, by visual evidence if you have taken prisoner so many tdf of soldiers you can share pictures you can share videos we're waiting for uh, some sort of confirmation i think for